So I'm about to go out and do some homework. Here is my school bag. And it's like this. Today I felt like doing my homework at like a coffee shop or something. Do you guys want me to show you like what's in my tote bag? So my bag looks like this. I got it from Daiso for $2, but it's pretty big. That's why I got it. Inside I have my pencil case I've gone through before. I have a video going through my art supplies, my bag. I have my wallet. I don't know what brand it is, but it's cute. It opens up like this. I have my sketchbook. This is my personal sketchbook, but usually in my bag I will have um, some of my class sketchbooks. But I'm going to a coffee shop and I wanted to do some sketch. I want to do some sketching in there, and then the book I'm reading. I want to finish this in a few days. Um, I'm planning to maybe make a video reviewing it, perhaps. I think it would be really helpful. You, know, you can see I tapped off a bunch of stuff. I have two items right now. My French notebook <laughs> and then my iPad and it has the keyboard extension. Pretty much that's what's in my bag. And then little design it says I'm full of charm. I hope something good happens. And I know it kind of doesn't, I think it does make sense, but I thought it was really cute. And I was just like, I think it'd be funny if someone read that while I was walking by.
So I'm gonna be painting all of these black, kind of like this one, and then perhaps starting to glue. I'm here so early. I didn't put any makeup on or anything. I kind of get scared filming in here because like, it's an open studio. It's open till 10 p.m. So literally like other students can come in here, but I guess it'll just be awkward for like a second if someone does come in. This is one of the studios. So there's a wood shop on in there and this is kind of just like supplies. And then we have these big tables, these tables, and then we have an outdoor studio. And then next, I think there's four other studios. There are other studios, but those are all like drawing and painting studios. And then these are more like heavy work. I've been here since 11 and it's now 8. I was working on a project all day. Well, I don't know what to say. Hey y'all, so I'm at school right now. <laughs> I don't think I've talked much this vlog, but recently I did have a birthday. I turned 23. So recently I did turn 23. I don't know how I feel about it because I honestly still feel really young because I'm still treated like I'm young because I look really young. So now it's even worse because when I go to like the store and stuff to buy alcohol, um, the cash register person is always like skeptical of me. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't really feel different. I just feel like my time is crunched now. Like I feel like I have to figure shit out soon. I don't know how to describe it. Like I feel like it's not that deep, but at the same time it is because I'm like, okay, um, yeah. Not a lot of thoughts about it. Just a lot of thought. Oop. <laughs> Just a lot a, of contemplating life <laughs> and getting older, but I don't really feel older. I think once I start aging in my face, that's when I'm going to start feeling older. But right now, I feel the same. I'm, I'm content. I think that where I'm at right now, I made a lot of progress compared to when I was like 21 and 22. I'm basically still 22. It hasn't, I haven't been 23 that long, but I don't know. I definitely feel my mindset shifting and I, I have definitely a lot of different thoughts than I did before about life itself and the meaning of life, which sounds so corny, but like I really be having that kind of like adult awakening, which is really interesting, but it's also fun, I guess, because I feel like life is changing for me and yeah, I don't know. But I don't have much else to say about it. It's just, it was just another day, another year. <laughs> and I'm still working towards the same goals that I've always wanted. And I think that's, I'm proud of myself for that. I'm proud of sticking to what I love and what I want to do. And just going like full force with it. But, um... Yeah, I think this is the end of the vlog. I haven't been posting much, but honestly, I've been so busy, like so, so busy, but I have a couple video ideas that I want to get out there, hopefully. I don't see you guys soon. I hope you guys are doing well, um, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.